Welcome to hashtag Supercon line. This is the Florida Supercon stream. Today it is the anniversary of The Witcher, and we are celebrating by uh, by enjoying some Witcher here. We've got a couple of people on air uh, in order. I think I'm going to start with myself, of course. Hey guys, my name's Sean, uh, aka uh, Geralt of Rivia. <laughs> It's pronounced Geralt, right? It's I think it's pronounced Gary. Gary. Hey, what's up? It's like uh, Parks and Rec. Nobody's no, like Gary 100% the sure. <laughs> right. Uh, uh. Um, up next, you've got... Uh, oh, yeah. Did I finish my introduction? Hi, Sean. Marketing manager for Florida Supercon. Uh, got Sarah introducing. Us. First time on the Supercon stream. Hi, guys. I'm Sarah. Um, I... Do I mention that I'm an Emerald City person, or do you want to say? Yeah, <laughs> well, you just did. Um, <laughs> you just did. Uh, yeah, it's not the um, I'm so the brand marketing fine. coordinator for Emerald City. Um, I obviously hang out with the Supercon team as much as possible because they do all these fun things. And Witcher is one of the latest shows that I've binged, but also one of my favorites. Um, only got through the first book, so I can't wait to see what the game's all about. And following me is Derek. Hey, I'm Derek. I work on uh, Supercon's marketing team with Sean. Uh, I am playing this game, so blame me. Uh, if I die a lot, uh, don't blame anybody else. So, uh, like we said, uh, today is the anniversary of The Witcher. Hey, what have you guys done today? Uh, it's actually the the tenth anniversary. What have you guys done today on Witcher Day to celebrate our favorite uh, monster hunter? I wore a black sweater and braided my hair. <laughs> <laughs> That's about, it. and then pretty much saying toss a coin to your Witcher all day, and you know, frustrated my mom a little bit. That's about as far as I got on the celebration. That works. I clearly have uh, dyed my hair. I got my contacts in. I uh, made sure to put, I had to make sure which eye it was. Uh, a realistic star, scar. Do we, uh, okay, so we, I will admit, I am a little bit behind on Witcher lore. I have only played a little bit of the game and okay. have only seen two episodes of the show. Yeah, so no. I'm I'm the noob when it comes to, hey, what's up, Christian or Christina? How you doing, Christina? Just saying hi to the comments here. Uh, so, do you guys know how he got the scar? The scar that I'm actually not sure about. I'm pretty sure it's not in the books. Yeah, I feel like, like he's I just I had only, it. Yeah, I only read the first book, and that's like a bunch of short stories, so it's not. I don't know if there was something that I might have missed, but I think it's only in the show and the game. Okay. Are we competing for who can find the answer first? <laughs> well, I'm pulling up the answer by Googling <laughs> and I'm trying to find out. Uh, I'm, gonna, I'm testing you guys, actual Witcher fans. So as Sarah has said, she's read the book. She's just read the book. just the first book. You've mm -hmm. seen all of the show. Mm-hmm. Right. Um, Derek, you have played the game fully and completely, correct? Not fully and not completely. Wow. Well, <laughs> yeah. did, you, did you beat the story, correct? Uh, I haven't beat the story. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Take it all back. No, we have zero experts on the panel. What? How what far are you? A lot of things. So, so I played on my Xbox for, I don't know, I think I was like level 20 or 22. Um, and there was still a lot left to do in the story that I hadn't accomplished. Um, and then there was both expansions and like some of those expansions have won like awards, like just the expansion by itself, not even the, the main game. But so there's still a lot left for me to do, but I moved it over to PC cause I can do, I can add um, a ton of mods to it and make it look like really take advantage of everything that my computer has to offer. Um, so right now I am level nine not very far in the game. Uh, I'm still doing some of the quests on like this, the second area, I think, with Velen. Okay. So I will say then, you, you both have failed. Um, <laughs> but that's fine. Uh, 
this this was uh, this, this so far this is what I've discovered. The scar on his left eye actually appears in this game for the first time. And when asked about it by Siri, do we all know who Siri is? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. Spoiler alerts for anybody out there. Uh, she uh, she can manipulate space and time. And while she's you know chatting with him, uh, he says that he get got it from the cockatrice of Spala, and it was just another souvenir. So we haven't seen the full story. Maybe that's a DLC where you get to fight the cockatrice. I also don't want to be like that person, but I also Googled it. And I have a totally different answer. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay. Give it to me. It says that he encounters um, some person while he's, I don't want to like give anything away. I don't know what's in the game. What's not, but he's on a ship and he's going somewhere for execution that's also a spoiler sorry but then he says in order to escape he makes a pact with the man for his soul and he gets branded looks like rain oh that's the one on the side of his face he's got a isn't that the one i thought that was the one on his eye uh sorry that's the picture about... that they're lining up with that's scar right you are I'm, th I'm talking about the one that i have here the big one the big one you're talking about the one on the side of his face that he actually gets in the Wild Hunt yeah. expansion. Jeez, I'm yeah. so wow. sorry. The dude has got a lot of scars. Yeah, you I should, honestly you, have only seen this big one, and that's what I was like, oh yeah, scar. That makes sense. There's a scene in this game where you see his back, and it's just absolutely covered with scars. <gasps> right, he's like Batman in that regard. Yeah. yeah. Which is uh, interesting, because Batman just fights less monsters. Maybe I can find a Wait, why does he have scars monster. on his back? Batman he, or he the Witcher? Monsters. No. <laughs> the Witcher. We're talking about the Witcher. Batman is out. <laughs> <laughs> We're past Batman. There's a lot of parallels between the two, though. Right. So Wow, it's still raining. He has scars on his back because that's where monsters like to bite him. I am yeah. imagining. I'm just going to move forward with the story. Yes. D can you describe what um, mission this is? So this... Uh, the plot of The Witcher 3, um, at least, you know, in the beginning, is you're looking for Ciri. Um, the Wild Hunt, which is these, like, crazy frost demons from a f cold, fiery hell, um, are after her because of the power oh that she has, God. where she can control, like, space and time and all that cool stuff. And, and so he's, you... He's and literally, Jennifer, I'm sorry to interrupt, but he is sure. tracking monster poop right now, right? <laughs> uh, I think so. I think he's tracking... Um, if you looked at this guy... Uh, in that cutscene that we just saw, it kind of has a necklace of like donut oh. and treats and stuff like that. So he's tracking the treats donut that necklace. they're leaving for these crones of uh, Crookback Bog. So it's like your local witch, like you leave them stuff so that they don't eat you in the, in the night and things like that. Gotcha. Okay. Okay. Yep. All right. So so hunting Siri, they're tracking her down for her power. Right. And so Siri, uh, I believe, witches at some point. Um, and so your job is Geralt. So Geralt is like famously the best tracker in in all the land. Mm -hmm. um, and the game <laughs> does that by having like uh, uh, your Witcher senses. So you hold down, for me, it's left trigger. Um, and you can see stuff. So like I can see this, this, uh, this treasure chest. And it highlights things in the world. So these red things are like the things that, that people have left for these witches. And you'll see them on the ground too. Right. So I know, I know, Sarah, you said Batman's out, but again, <laughs> it reminds me a lot of Batman's bat sense. Yeah. Uh, not like a spider sense, but in the Batman video games, you just press a button and everything glows because he's so good at detective. I think right. it's called detective vision. I think it's called, Douglas like, in yeah. The kitchen, stole <gasps> a thing of meat. Cook gave him a licking, strung him by his feet. Terrible song. <laughs> it's supposed to be like a string of clues, like a, a riddle. Derek, that's a question for you. Uh, I think they're singing about how difficult their lives are, and that someone ate something else. Oh. So it's not like a riddle for you in the story, like to be like, oh, by the way, this is what's coming up. It's just totally I don't think so. Maybe. I mean, look at this place. Like, nothing good is going to happen here. I mean, he can take all of these kids, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Singing They're terrible really like, songs. Go away. I'm looking for the witches of Crookback Bog. You look like a witch yourself. Uh, w witches? 
of the bog. We can't go in the bog. Gran don't let us. When my brother Zamek went missing, Gran said it was because he went in the woods. Did you hear that music? Lost. Not creepy at all. Gran cried an awful lot after that. He could still come back. This whole scene is creepy, Derek. No woman got <laughs> lost in the swamp. I have yeah. so many bad vibes right now. <laughs> <laughs> see anyone like that? Ain't no lassies here. What am I? You're no lassie. Oh my god, do you think all of these kids are the witches? And they're all just gonna, like, transform? Oh, they, vo they uh, Voltron together into a witch? These dazzling soldiers with their tits. And it's torturing the poor lads. That's what he said. Oh my god, is are there kids on this? Oh, I mean, there's kids right here. Listen, oh my god, yeah, these kids are naughty. <laughs> <laughs> There's not like my real kids, though. Me, but you could try to help her. How do you know she was here? Yes, yeah, Geralt does swear a little bit. Witches in the swamp. Little, little, but little. There's no witches here. There's only frogs and snakes. Just frogs and, and snakes. Johnny. Can't trust the frogs. What's oh, Johnny. Talk? What kind of jabbering is this, eh? No one allowed here. Just kids. My kids. They're allowed. But who are you? Wearing swords like a bandit. Gosh. Uh, which one should I pick? Someone to pick for me. Sarah. Oh, oh no. Oh no. Oh no. I want to do between one or two. Like, who is Johnny? Who is Johnny? That's Johnny, a good question. Johnny ate a cat. Come the more <gasps> some furry shot. Watch your language. <laughs> Like Finally, someone tiles. standing up for tiles. <laughs> proper the tails. Just talking to the kids, ask them if they'd seen young woman. That's oh, I was a lovely young woman. <gasps> Wore a long, beautiful braid my mommy did up for me. Had dresses with flowers on them. Maybe you've seen her. Young, ashen hair. Your betrothed. Ooh. Daughter, actually. Oh. Daughter. <laughs> <laughs> My dear sweet little daughter and her sister. Where are they now? Maybe they've come to some harm. Can we just take a moment to appreciate Geralt's face? I mean, you guys have been appreciating it this whole time. That's true. That's a good point. So, yeah, Sean, no you, what is your plan to move forward with the show? Or the books? Or yeah. the game? Fame. Yeah. Um, I have the game. And oh, I've been uh, playing some of it. Uh, I just haven't gotten around to finishing. And I got very intimidated by like the first scene uh, was a lot of Witcher butt. <laughs> so I had to take a break. <laughs> I had to take a two week break to play Final Fantasy. Play it for 10 minutes and then stop. Right. Be gone. I did miss the last bit of that conversation, though. Sorry. No, it's fine. I think. We're gonna uh, in. Derek, what happened? We're gonna hunt uh, down. I don't know stuff. There's this one boy that Grand won't let me speak to. Is it Johnny? It's it's not Johnny. It's Travick. Can't come in here. <gasps> allowed in here. Let's oh, do rules out here in the bog. Not allowed. It's not allowed. He won't talk to you anyway. Grand don't like you. And and Johnny's made up. I'm stranger stale kids. This kid had a bad time. Just tell me where I can find Johnny. Johnny's made up. Be gone. Be gone. So what do you guys what do you guys think Johnny is? I have a feeling that Johnny is a big dog. Why wow. don't you want to talk about Johnny? One of you knows about it. Sarah, what do you think Johnny is? Too. It's just um, pals with Johnny. A big giant monster, or um, but Gran says Johnny's I don't know. Up. He's made up. What does that? I feel like that means something. Like he's not made up. Let me see if they've ever, you seen ever seen John. John. Of course, looks just like him. Then why do you say he's made up? Gran says so, and Gran knows lots. What? The girl I mentioned is in danger. You gotta help me get your Gran away from the hut so I can talk to Johnny's friend. Oh. Ooh, we're gonna play some tricks. <gasps> Yay! They hide and seek. Gran never does. Says her feet hurt. This is the content people want. Hide and seek what with kids. Geralt play hide and seek. <laughs> you hide with some swamp kids. You have to help. You Can I ask? Um, earlier, Gran commented on his swords. He does have two swords on his back, which yes. I feel is a little overkill. 
Really? What can one sword do that the other cannot? So uh, I'll answer that question, but also I want to point out he has a crossbow as well. Yeah, he does. Uh, (laughs) So he's heavily loaded. Um, So one sword is steel, and that's for like your normal sword fighting Mm -hmm. with like people and the and the humies. Um, And the other one is silver, which Geralt uses to kill monsters. So every monster in the game. So if I push this button. You can see in the bottom right-hand corner, it says steel weapon. Mm-hmm. So it looks a little bit different. And then I'll, I'll tap another button, and he will literally grab his other sword. And it's a silver sword, because this one's just for monsters. Okay, so again, I th- I'm pretty sure, unless this world has different rules, that a silver sword would be just as effective on humans as it is on <laughs> monsters. That That is true, I can see but you. it's more effective on monsters than the steel sword is. Okay. Sure. So it's more about it's more about the monsters versus like the uh, which way are these feet going? And Sean, it's way cooler having two. Like, what are you gonna do? Like, yeah, have one on. sword as I don't. Think I don't so. know. Maybe move faster when you're hunting kids. He looks like he's moving fine. Can I go up here? No. Okay. All right. <gasps> Did you just fall off the roof? Nah. <gasps> so wait, what are the red footsteps? What's so the- these red footsteps. We're playing hide and seek. Remember. Oh, right. Sorry. Yeah, mm-hmm. but Geralt is really good at hide and seek. He's using his see. powers for hide and seek? Wow. He uses his witcher senses. He can smell crazy things. He can see crazy things. Honestly, that's kind of like cheating, don't you think? It I know we're trying to find somebody cheating. right now, but I think yeah. this is... I wouldn't want to play with Geralt. Uh, actually, sometimes, so sometimes I call him Gary. I love um, Gary. It's definitely not Found you. in the Every lore. Last one. So nobody else should do that. But <laughs> I think it really spices things up, if you know what I mean. Tell him I let you find me. Found you all. Now you gotta keep your word and help me talk to Johnny's friend. Why wouldn't we? Promise, didn't we? Alright, time to distract Gran. We'll get in here, we'll talk to this kid, we'll find Johnny, Gran! and we're one step Gran! closer. Alright, I'm really hoping it's a giant Gran, dog. Yours. Gran! Come. I don't know. I'm kind of scared. I want to Google it ahead of time. I'm so nervous. <laughs> what level stealth do you think Geralt is? Mm-hmm. Don't be afraid. <clears throat> don't know nothing. I won't hurt you. I will say, Where's Geralt is, is very gruff. She's he is, busy. He's not super caring, but he's never like I deliberately mean. Johnny. He could know more than you. You know what I mean? Like he's not out to hurt, hurt these kids. Him, right? It's very clear. Like he's real. everything will be he's fine. He up. just wants like whatever information he's I'm after. Not gonna hurt him. Johnny used to be boy. My grand like listening to his songs. When we was picking mushrooms, Johnny said he saw a girl with ashen hair in the swamp. Where can I find Johnny? In the swamp. <laughs> <laughs> because he's a monster in he's the swamp. A swamp monster, yeah. Oh, he's what are those? What are they called? A kikimora? Oh, I think there are kikimoras. Or he's gonna run into one, and it's gonna be a big old problem. Wow. Just looking for this guy, Johnny. Yep. Look for Johnny in the swamp. Okay. Oh, so the while, little map is cute. Wow, it, <laughs> it's one of the biggest map, uh, fantasy maps in game, in in games out there. Oh, really? Yeah. What an interesting piece of trivia, Sean. Yep. Love that, Brad. That one I knew. Uh, oh, another. Cool. We're going to do another quiz. Oh, All right. God. So, uh, Jerry here. Oh, wait. Is that Johnny already? No, this is just a random drowner. Okay. Note, note the use of the silver sword, viewers, for the oh, monsters. It's like a giant um, sigh. It's almost like something that Raphael the Ninja Turtle would carry. Um, is this, this is the music from the game? This uh, it's like quick Celtic uh, ballad here. Yeah. Okay. I, like I can barely hear the music. It's like a dude rocking out. Usually, <laughs> yeah, usually the music it's the instrumental, but there's intense. a guy yelling at us. Um. Okay. So uh, Jerry is uh, or Gary. He's known as the Butcher of Blaviken. Small yep. foot. Right. Uh, who knows where he earned that name? Blaviken. Mm, okay. Maybe the question <laughs> should be more of why did he earn it? 
Didn't he just kill like a bunch of um? I don't know if these are bad people, but didn't he just go into town and just kill a bunch of um? What do you call them? I don't know what the word is I'm looking for. That's... But it was like it just like got in the way, and he just like killed a bunch of people, and everyone was like, "Well, you just killed a bunch of people. Great." I know the mate doesn't help, but and I don't know the word I'm looking for, but it wasn't like a non-purposeful kill, but it was also like he just made a mess. Isn't that it? I mean, kind of. Do you know? Do you remember what drove him to murder uh, six people? Maybe so seven. It just like a were word? they under like, some kind of mind just... control spell? Was it? Oh, was it more in depth? I'm thinking like it was just like an argument. So okay, so you you both are kind of right. Um, right. Teamwork. Based <laughs> based on there. what I found. <laughs> based on what I found, he uh, there were people. There was like a a gang trying to kill a mage in okay. the city and the only way he could stop it right because the the fight with the mage between these people would have just caused way more casualties in the city so he did the lesser of two evils and just killed the two the the few people who were trying to um to all right louise says he killed the mage's henchmen but what i see is that he killed the six or seven people trying to kill the mage and then the alderman said, "Never come back." Uh, wow, after is, he, he did his work. This is the uh, the myth, the legend of of Geralt of Rivia. There's like five different stories. Anything there could have happened, right? Yeah. And I'm cheating, <laughs> <laughs> so I don't know what to believe anymore. Yo, Johnny is bad. This is it. This is Johnny. Are you ready? Sorry. Is Johnny I'm a regular kidding. sized dog? Because if he's a regular sized dog, and you don't have to <laughs> kill him. Ew. Oh, Ooh. it looks like Gollum. Don't be afraid. Oh, Johnny's just like a chill dude living in the swamp. Yeah, until he turns into something else. <laughs> You're a bucka? What'd you call me? Luton? He's not a bucka. He's not a Luton. Ah, a godling. He's a godling. How many of you left? I'm looking for a woman with ashes. That's how I blink, too. <laughs> Tell me everything. That's Stop. so creepy. Where did you see her? What was she doing? It's important to me. Why not? Oof. What's what do you wrong? think happened? Can't talk? Speculate wildly, please. Why, Why he can't talk? Yeah. Um. Lost your voice? Oh, I, I was going to say because Grand cut his tongue out or something weird. Oh man, that's harsh. Sorry. Oof. Sorry, we got this far and Johnny can't talk. Are you kidding? <laughs> <laughs> he lost his voice. It was like, obviously they're trying to get him to keep a secret. So, and I look up what a godling is uh -huh. um, to get more information, maybe to, to deepen our understanding of Johnny here. Mm -hmm. um, we learn that godlings are woodland creatures dwelling in burrows and moss covered hollow stumps on the outskirts of human settlements, which we know from Johnny. So Johnny is the quintessential godling. Um, Guys, I leveled up. I'm sorry. It's very important that I do this real quick. <gasps> Why? Because then I, I have stronger abilities. So the way that this works is um, if if I have three blue abilities, these intensifiers right here, mm -hmm. and it will increase, uh, it's a mut mutagen, it'll increase the intensity of math science. So I can put a similar one on the right hand side uh, with a red one, um, and that will make, I think it increases my attack power. Yeah. This guy. <gasps> wow. Look at that. That was awesome. Yes. All right, now you can throw away one of your swords. <laughs> <laughs> Sean, Sean, drop the sword thing. It's they both gotta stay, okay? Drop the regular sword. Just... Oh my god! I don't even think I can unequip them. Damn oh, these guys! Can you like does lock challenge the Witcher and? <laughs> um, I'm going to be honest. And Derek's camera froze on a picture of him smiling, like. 15 minutes ago. So I just, every time I look, I'm like, he's still laughing at the last thing I said. I'm doing great today. <laughs> Wait, Derek's photo has been that whole, for me the whole time. Yeah. <laughs> That's how I feel about this game. That's actually hilarious. That's a, yeah, great, it's a great game. It's I a would great definitely, if I were you, I would buy this game and I would play it. 
so uh, we do have the link, I believe, in the description. If it's not there, we should we should drop it in there. If anybody wants to pick up the game on the anniversary, I will say, <laughs> Philip. We have a comment saying that the controls aren't great. How are you dealing with the controls in the game so far? On the layer. Yeah, there's like there's a couple times. So I played uh, Red Dead Redemption Two, um, uh, like a little after it came out, and I'll say that the horse mechanics in Red Dead Redemption Two were just they were insane. They were like, like the horse was an extension of myself. Um, Roach is not like that at all. He is. <laughs> unruly he goes where he wants like it's, it's a little iffy um i like some people uh, like aren't crazy fans about the combats because you saw me like dodging around uh -huh. a lot it's it's almost like you're dancing mm. um i don't really have a problem with it uh at like after a certain a little while i'll, I'll turn the difficulty oh, what is this thing uh i'll turn the difficulty up uh okay she used the cross there you go <laughs> All right, Camilla finally has. We have a comment explaining the true use. The silver sword is only good for monsters because the metal is softer and therefore not good for normal fights. That's the only explanation that makes sense to me. I think there's actually a video of Henry explaining it, um, which is kind of <laughs> crazy awesome if you like Henry at all, but. Um, we should find that link and share it as well. But he explains both swords pretty well. I are you, are you on a first name basis with Henry Cavill? Is that what I'm hearing? <laughs> I tried to make it like subtle, Derek, but if you want to call <laughs> me out, sure. <laughs> yes, I am. Where did he go? Where's this thing? Come out. Got him. Woo! <laughs> so that was a wyvern. That's like so mean. No, I think I was trying to eat him. It's, yeah. it's true, something yeah. about mutagen. I didn't know there were mutants. But yeah, you, they, uh, yeah. All right, what do we got in here? Are there eggs in there? No, there's a there's a raven's feather and there's a sealed I bottle. This bottle. All right, let's see if his voice was in here. So uh, about the controls, um, like yeah, they're a little iffy sometimes, but um, I've also downloaded a. A couple of mods that that change the controls mm. so like there's one that was uh made by one of the developers on the game who was like i just want it to be a little different that like puts a, like a lot of little tweaks in yeah. there um so if you have it on a pc you can you can download some some mods that change the way that the game plays <gasps> uh, mine was do? very subtle but there's like even more <gasps> extreme ones whiskey slither ringworm rubbish bumblebee <gasps> Flabbergasted! Ha! The sound of it! Peter Piper, Pit, Prince Proximo, a pack of pickled peppers by the pontar. <laughs> what the heck? <laughs> I would also like to say Bumblebee if I haven't spoken in a while. <laughs> or rubbish. Flabbergasted. Rubbish. Thank you for this, noble whoever you are. Long be your life. Hang on a minute. I helped you, now you help yeah. me. He's what, like, peace out. Turn this beautiful act of altruism into a banal bartering of favors. <gasps> that. that was a nice sentence. How do you bottle someone's voice? Who wants the answer to this question? I would love to learn that. <laughs> been trying to figure it out. <laughs> YouTube right. tutorials We're have looking failed for me. Somebody. Especially as mine's a voice to crown all voices. Sometimes it's like a forest brook. At others, like a roll of thunder. And let's be honest, I talk enough to fill three barrels or more. Yeah, he does. Somebody used some powerful magic on you as a prank or just to be mean. I'm looking for a young, ashen-haired woman. See anyone like that? Did I ever? Remember it as if it were yesterday. Soon as I woke, I went to empty my bowels. <laughs> Good morning routine. <laughs> Downright glorious. Suddenly heard a bang, so loud it couldn't have been me. And that lass appeared, out of nowhere. Young, ashen-haired, just like you said. Wounded and panting to boot. She raced off towards the children's hut. Quick as if the crones were after her. I yelled some unpleasantries. She disturbed my mom. Sadly, I'd lost my voice, so I don't think she heard me. Who are the crones? These are just the witches in the forest. 
about the crones. They're and like bog witches. Cruel, vindictive, not to be crossed. What if someone does cross them? Might take his voice, might take his life. It depends <gasps> on the Yeah. They're nasty, although they care for this land and its folk in their own way. Supposedly, they always keep their word. You must be careful what you ask for. Won't find them until they want to be found. See them until they want to be seen. But remember, they see and hear all that happens in the Maya. Oof, like the Eye of Sauron. Wait, so he, you, we can literally ask him all these questions. That's, this is probably like a silly question for the game. But like, we can go through each single question and ask him. It's not like we have to like, just ask him one question. We can, I feel like that's like kind of... Don't even ask that. I, I think it. I think it depends on the game. Sometimes they yeah. force you to choose, and other times they let you continue to ask all of them as you go down. Like right. I like getting the info, but then I feel like there's I one know. in most. Seems like a Sarah, weird thing. Do you play a lot of uh, RPGs or no? I don't want to be that person, but I don't play. I don't okay. Play uh, so <laughs> in in a lot of RPGs, especially. Uh, ones like this, there's like conversation trees, and so mm -hmm. the top one, and in this case, it's highlighted gold, like advances the plot or the story, or whoops, that was the wrong button, or whatever. Um, and that's what it does. And like other ones will give you more information or like filler stuff that's helpful but not necessary to move forward. Oof, come over here. If only games could um, could really show the frustration in someone when you ask them six or seven questions like that in a row. <laughs> Imagine a, a conversation with that in real life. I feel like the bog, the godlike child would be like, Oh, really? You don't know about the crones? Get off my back, witcher. Where did Johnny go? Come on, Johnny. Let's go. Come on. So uh, Geralt has signs in the game, just like he does in the show. Um, in the show, they go, do a good job of like, just they just happen and they don't really talk about them. Um, but in the game, you have Quen, Yerdin, Igni, Axi, and Ard. Um, the one I'm using right now is uh, Quen, which is basically a shield. It's, I think it's the most useful one. But there's one that shoots fire. There's one that is a like a telekinetic blast. There's one that's like mind control, but not really. Uh, and then there's one that's a, a trap. And they're all very, very useful. Good. I want to see examples of all of them in the game. So, okay, all right. I need to sing to grab. At the same time. Is that possible? No, no. Okay, I just thought I'd throw one more catch out there. Yeah, yeah. No, I appreciate that, though. I'll try and <laughs> I'll try and use them in the next combat that I'm in. Little Johnny soft. Ew, ew, I don't like this. But Spark jumped out and whispered, Listen, I'll tell <gasps> Oh, he's hypnotizing her. Yeah. You got your voice back. Or not. Oh, She's just I don't know. I feel like she took his voice. Process. I shall look for it when I get home. You're not allowed here, Johnny. Oh, Johnny. You shouldn't have come. Oh, no. Calm down, Gran. Don't get angry. It's not good for you. <gasps> The woman I asked about earlier. Forgive me, Gran, but this fellow absolutely must talk to the ladies. No, she's not allowed. Please, it's important. The fellow will be quiet. I really thought she would have given in by now. Hear me out. I found yeah, she's got a lot of rules. Did I not? Did I break Jenny's fever too? I did. Man, he's cashing in the all these favors. Show. And he literally just was like, Witcher, you can't ask me any favors even though you gave my voice back. What is happening? <laughs> because otherwise he'll pester me day and night, even during potty time. Even His during potty time. Perhaps the uh. ladies can help find her, eh? Well, since you put it that way, Johnny, I'll help him. Oh, he just had to say potty time, time and she was like, yeah, <laughs> let's go. <laughs> Game is weird, man. I like kind of want to play it, but <laughs> it's uh yeah. There's a uh, a few places where there's like some stuff that happens. This place, ugh, ugh. I'm not gonna.
I mean, this place seems pretty cool. Johnny's a good lad. <laughs> Don't like All these hooks. I would rather be in this building than be outside in the field with Johnny singing a song. <laughs> <laughs> Who are the women in the tapestry? <gasps> oh. Ladies lovely, with power over all, beseech I thee, answer my call. Before you, a worm crawls, wretched and uh, Do you see the eye at the top of this painting? No. I missed it. Did it move? <gasps> oh my goodness. <gasps> How dare you disturb our rest, woman? Oh, crud. Way to go, Derek. <laughs> Did you see the eye? Oh, oh, yeah, oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, oh, I'm looking for the woman with ashen hair. I know you met her. Where is she? Oh, he's impatient. Geralt is so impatient. But he also just had to go through like 500 different kids to get here. <laughs> it's taking him all day. It's clear you met her. Tell me everything. That was blunt. Well, perhaps it's for the best. Tell me, have you got bollocks? Do you fear woodland beasts? Yeah. Is that two separate questions? Oh, Although that an ear? Eyes are upon this white-haired one. Brother has turned against brother. The land is soaked in blood. Evil rains. Is that tree coming in from outside? Before. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> that's, uh, that's no one saw anything. Mind. No one saw anything. <laughs> Magic. <laughs> I really liked the, that last line reading. Those must have been a fun one in the audio recording booth. But I against but I The Alderman of Downward. Like not even close, Sean, but <laughs> I've seen Brave. And now our servant will bring you the dagger. Do you see that dagger? She's holding in the painting. Yeah, she's just gonna. You guys wondering why I need a dagger? There's a lot of sword rules. Please tell us. <laughs> what for? When the alderman sees this dagger, he'll know we sent you. He'll eat with Is that an ear? Yes, that's what I was saying before. Ugh. I think. I'll talk to the alderman, but I can't promise anything. Ooh, woman, give the young man the dagger. And you, white one. Return only once you've completed the task. Oh, you mistress, right on me way. Dagger, gotta bring the dagger. So this lady's day to day is to take yeah. care of random kids, <laughs> random like to give it to you. bog Swamp kids, you. kid, yeah, the dagger. and then oversee. Witch's uh, cabin. Yep. Can we just talk about the shine on the dagger? Like, wow. Yeah. It was beautiful. It was. Look at that stubborn tree still sticking through the wall. <laughs> it wants to play the game. Can you even? See, you can't even see it. Not in the cutscene. That that just goes to show you. Oh no, there it is. It's just there. Huh. This place is not. What is that? Are those bats? Yeah, yeah leave them alone. Petrified bats? That's the best way to keep them. <laughs> it seals in the flavor. Ooh, yes, loot. The Are you looking for stuff? Uh, oh, I never read these. I'm sure that there's people that read those. I never read them. Derek. I know. Do you want to read the whole thing? Yeah. I would listen to... Wait, so to... if you get a book, how do you read it? Like, what is it? It's, uh, it's a no, you you know more. Oh, I was just gonna say it's a book, and you just read it. <laughs> but it's like a book in the game that you're reading as a player. Yeah. Oh uh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, this this gas is poisonous. This is bad. You want to see some fire? I'll show you some fire. <laughs> wow. Also, do you have to kill these things every time you go outside of a building? No, it's just they live in swamps. 
They're basically we, swamp creatures. I feel like we've seen them everywhere. I mean, I'm in a swamp, so... Get back here. What are you... Great. Oh, now I hear the music. Very yeah. intense stuff. Oh, do you guys want to see Roach? Let's yes. See if we can get over here. So Roach is uh, Gary's horse. Come on, buddy. Let's go. Look at that. <laughs> so, uh, Sean... Oh, there's more poison here. That's great. So, um, an interesting piece of trivia is uh, Gerald actually names every horse that he ever has Roach. Sure. Um, and they're, they're different horses, like, throughout. But he always names them Roach. Okay. It's because it's hard to remember horse names. Yes, it is. Is this the guy? Is this the guy? That was easy. Okay, that means right there. Nice village. Can you imagine just standing oh, outside in the rain all day, curl of a waiting for some witcher to show up and talk <laughs> to you? You get by all right? Well, I ain't winter to winter. Well, now we survive. He also has got like a very Robin yeah. Hoodie theme dagger. going on, which I love. Wow, look at this dagger. My master. I didn't know you belonged to them. <gasps> Uh-oh. Oh, Geralt does not belong to anybody. Don't belong Dead. to anyone. Down to business. I want to get this done quickly. Ah, so that's how it's to be. I'm supposed to help solve your problem. Tell me what it is. Just the essentials. The war awoke an ancient power. An evil one that feeds on bloodshed. Nightmares haunt our nights and days. Folks sleepwalk from their homes, never to return. Wow. This really took a turn. Whispering hill, they lie. It's the middle of the night. It's raining. This guy's not having a good time. Remember a little bit ago when we were playing hide and seek with some kids? <laughs> Folk are afeard to me. <laughs> you must go there. The dark powers must be cast off. I guess. When did all this start? Three years back. I remember. Three years. Warm day. Yep. Went to check the snares. He's been having again. a bad three years. Pulled the hair from the trap. It grew dark all of a sudden, though it was nigh on noontime. Thought it was a storm at first. A squeal pierced the air. It, it is straight up raining. Like, in the you should be indoors. <laughs> 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 yeah. Times have been ill ever since. Folks' teeth turn black as charcoal. Women folk fight like polecats, bawling and brawling over nothing. Woman, right? The young'uns. Hey. <laughs> Wait a minute. <laughs> is he in the game? Is he the last of his Draw. kind? Like in the like whole like in all of the games? Is he the only Witcher around? Geralt? Yeah. No. Of the wood don't know so what uh, I think he is. I know all. Say Maybe. It again? Oh, there's one other, right? What's her name? So, um, Stop respecting him. uh, Vesemir, who witches. taught Geralt everything, is a witcher, and they then there's two you. other witchers I that you meet back at him. uh, Kaer Morhen. Careful, Master. Witcher. Um, and then Siri Don't is a witcher, too. I don't know if you guys do that. One. Yes, that's yeah. the one I thought. Yeah, so there's, there's a, a few others, but like, and there's different schools, so like, okay. For example, if I go to treasure hunts, you can see there's like there's the cat school, there's the wolf school, there's uh, some other schools that I'm not remembering. But there's different schools of witchers. Um, so like Geralt, he's he's the white wolf. He has the wolf medallion, so he's part of the wolf school. But all these other people, have, they do things like a little bit differently. It's like a cast or like something like that. Yeah. I, so I did play the first witcher for a bit. Um, Let's go. And you are at witcher school. You know, in house, witching. you know, witch and door, <laughs> collecting points for your team. <laughs> and uh, they attack and kill all your friends. Um, and let's talk about bad controls, because the first one was very bad controls. Uh, so, yeah, I was under the impression that they were all dead. Oh, okay. All right. Yep. Roach doesn't want to go over that hill. Yeah, Roach, Roach does what he wants. Could you hunt those deer and uh, collect the meat for later? I could. I definitely could. Don't, I, don't, I, don't, I don't know. What is that? Bites. <gasps> oh. That looked like a deer, and I was like, wow, look at you. Lucky day. You can also uh, 
pretty much every. Come no closer. What? I know whence you come. Uh, and you reply, I just wanted this parsley for my lasagna <laughs> later. I'm gonna make a. <laughs> I'm gonna make a pasta. Let's protect me. They oh, sense whence you come. So I will say. Uh, I remember playing this class in my first playthrough, and it was one of the ones that I was like, I'm real creeped out. I need to just like take a minute. So I'm glad that you guys are here with me. Oh. Yeah. What is that? <gasps> what the heck? Is that the big dog that I thought Johnny was this whole time? So that, uh, the sign that I just used on this wolf was Axie, which slowed it down. Mm -hmm. Is there another wolf? Could you? That's agile. And I feel like I couldn't click all these buttons that fast. Is that awful? How used to it are you now? That you're just I like mean, I'm used to everything. I'm I'm so used to it. Yeah. Um, you could play just... the easy mode if you want. Could, oh, yeah. I would. I would. Yeah, that's jumping required here. here. So the funny thing is, is that you know the Witcher fights monsters and. These are wolves, so that would I imagine that would be hard to beat some some random wolves. But I think the villagers could have handled a tree, you know. You just chop it down. <laughs> this and tree, look how big this tree is. Yeah, it would take a while. Harold is. I'm not is saying it, it would take a while. Is there something in the tree? Oh, let me. I'll show you. You'll see. Oh, this okay. Is a very dangerous drop. So there is fall damage in the game. <gasps> right. Yep. Definitely Can don't you... fall. What happens if uh, you fall with Roach? Uh, Be gone. Be gone. Be gone. Well, that's more than a regular wolf. I yeah, would sure recommend the Silver Sword. Yep, yeah, that's definitely a werewolf. What's up, guy? So, let me show you something cool. Yay! So Geralt apparently keeps meticulous notes. I don't know where he keeps them. But you can see all the different uh, cre uh, monsters that you fought. Um, so, for instance, these are all some creepy hybrids. Uh, I thought they were under here. Where are you? Spectre? No. Vampires? No. Relics? No. Cursed ones? Ah, yes. So, werewolves are cursed ones. And so they have this nice little lore on the right hand side. And then it also tells you what they're vulnerable against. Zoom in a little bit there. So, there's bombs, and then. Uh, Geralt can make oils, and then he puts those oils on his sword, and then ah. it does extra damage. And then Igni is the fire one. Do you have time to oil your sword right now? Yeah, so I uh, mm -hmm. so I have a really cool mod that auto-applies oils. Oh. Well, yeah, because what? ain't nobody got time to apply all these oils themselves. Sure. Yeah, so... Oh, I don't have this slotted. So see how it says 10% attack power versus cursed ones? Yeah. That's that's the oil. That's the um, good stuff. That's that's it right there. It's like icy I, hot for for your sword. Yes, I am gonna put some so you can enhance your weapons with uh, rune stones. Yeah, we've I, uh, we've all seen materia slots before. Uh, <laughs> the wolf, the werewolf is like, I'm out. Wait, the He's werewolf has got oil. <laughs> Wait, did he just stun me? It looked like your shield protected you from a, from a hit. Ooh, he has he's got some health. Uh let me use this fire thing, Sarah, just for yeah. you. Thank you. Ow. Oh, sorry. Okay. How long does it take to kill a werewolf? Oh my gosh. So werewolves regenerate their health? Yeah, you gotta kill them fast. Like that yeah. fast? That's why they run away. <gasps> Ew, is that what it was doing right there? Gross. Oof. That's rough. Oh, Show you. man. I'm really I don't want to make this like any less than what it is, because this is really scary, but that kind of sounded like Stewie from Family Guy, so I feel okay <laughs> about it. I <laughs> think I feel a little bit better about what we're gonna get into because I'm so scared right now. <laughs> Awesome. Congratulations. That was cool. 
All right, this guy. I'm gonna save. Oh, Should it's always one of those. save a lot. Okay. Yeah, it's one. It's definitely one of those. Let's uh, let's do this real. Quick. Are we going in the tree? Well, we're underneath the tree. <gasps> This is what, like, I forget, what, I, is it episode three in the show where he goes into the castle and, like, this is what it's like. It's literally, like, you sweat the whole time because it's just dark and you don't know what it's about to happen, but you know something scary is about to happen. This is how I feel right now. I can't relive this again, you guys. I'm going to get claustrophobic in this water. Ew. All right, Gary, where are we going? <gasps> going around. What? This is so cool. Is this? I'm gonna get claustrophobic. Wait, I gotta find this empty <laughs> bag. I got a master crafted silver sword recipe. It seems I'm really like it's glad right. someone left a recipe for a sword underneath the ancient tree that talks to you. That's only useful for witchers. It's not talking to right. you, it's warning you. Hello, there's a difference. Do you think it uh, warns away everyone? I think like on Tuesdays it's like, actually, go close. <laughs> I'm pretty bored today. <laughs> Well, it did, wanna... didn't it tell him that he knew why he was there? Like, he knew what uh, Gary was doing there. I love that you're calling him Gary now. I'm sorry, you picked it up, it's just, it's <laughs> too good. <gasps> Ew. Oh, so it's like a Feed Me Seymour situation. Yeah. Who are you? I abandoned my circle, where I kept the balance. So is this, he, this creature is referencing like a circle of, of mages or sorceresses or druids, um, which is like a lot of magic users in this world like group together, uh, I assume, so they have more buying power when they go to the market. Why did they kill you? The crones want this land. They drew the wood alone. I stood in their way. I have to die. Oh my gosh, that's kind of intense, no? And they just made you a tree man for fun? I was attacked. This is my princess. A fortress besieged. Murderers I await. And my forest protects me. Murderers? Murderous sisters. Killed my body. Now my soul they hunt. For I did my so this thing is referencing the crones. So the crones sent him here because they thought they, that he would just die on this quest? Like, the crones sent Geralt here to kill this thing because the crones are, like, out to get this thing. But, uh, like, really it's why? Trick. Because it's, like, a... He's... Or this thing is, like, a threat? But... Is he a then, threat? He's just chilling. Sorry, he's a threat to the crones, not to yeah. Geralt. And so then the people who did this to him are not the crones. No, they are the crones. They are the crones. The crones are trying to fix their own mistake. They're trying to end this creature once and for all. It yeah. seems like the crones created their own problem. Yeah. That's true. Yeah. Okay. Just making sure. <laughs> I also feel like, do we have to kill this thing? What if we don't? Something threatens the ordinance. I'll help myself. The children have to take up. I come here, I got I shall Oh, now we have to trust the gross tree thing. Do I trust this this tree thing, or do I trust the crones? What else do we know about this tree thing? We only have its word. Can we get more info? Let's get more info. Press X to doubt. <laughs> Can we phone a friend? I'm confused. <laughs> yeah. Where is Johnny? Let's talk to Yana first. Let's do things. All life here serves them. The sisters live concealed. You will not find them. They hear war. You cannot hide. That didn't help. That didn't help. Why do you think the kids from the meadow are in danger? The sisters took them. They shall not return. Alright. I think I know my, what my call would be. <laughs> it cannot be entered. There are no rules to art serving. They shall all die. Let them be saved. What would you do, Sean? I would help the tree thing. You would help the tree thing? Yep. Oof. 
I'm kind of concerned now, and I feel like everything the tree thing is saying it doesn't really make any sense. And it's saying that things can't be undone because they're already done. So why not just kill the tree thing and then go back and try to kill the crones? So you just kill everybody, pure chaos. <laughs> 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 they don't call me the butcher for no reason. I'm just saying. Killing, like, I think, might as well. Killing the tree thing frees it, right? Frees it from its torture. Yeah. But yeah. it also can help save the kids. Maybe if it's not lying. What's, what else would it? What else could it do? Worst case, that you free it and it goes ha ha ha, I tricked you, <laughs> and then you stab it with a silver sword. I don't know, man. These things. Its voice totally it never changes. turns out like you think <laughs> it turns out. Um, are you saying I should I should help this tree thing? Just That's my it. call, but I mean. I'm gonna do it. Sean wants to see what happens. I want to see what happens, so we could all freak out. I will find them, free them, open the door of my cage. Blood is my escape. The right you must perform with the black of raven feathers. The white. Oh no! It's a fetch quest. I was kind of hoping that you could free him, and then we could see what would happen immediately. Yeah, like, there's so much stuff. Yeah, this is a long ritual. The only way this is good is if he's like, and all of this is in a chest right over there. <laughs> I don't know. I've never taken part in any rituals that were quick and then were good, you know? Like, all the good rituals take time. Uh, but also, the only problem is now is that tree thing literally was like the crones here in Seal. So is this going to be another problem while he's going and looking for this? I don't know, the crones, like, I feel like they're, they're like, low-key, you know? They don't want to do anything. To, like, mind their own business. Did I miss something? I just gotta describe what I'm looking for. Did his so voice I think I need change when... Yeah, the voice totally changed. Why do we need a black horse? Why do we need a black horse? Oh my gosh, what if this thing is the crones, and it's the only way to set the crones free? So wow, many that blew my mind. <laughs> yeah. It is that possible? I don't know. I feel like I'm just you, making you blew my mind so stuff. much that my uh, my gray highlights were disappearing. My bones, they lie in a solitary mound nearby. Do less. Oh. I'll gather what Does I Does Geralt look like he carries a compass? Come on. Father, and return to the Hillamix depths. The heart. I'm getting like some Dark Souls vibes from this thing. Yeah, it's pretty gross. Yeah. I never want to see a tree pulsate like this. It's like all spiky. Are you sure? I feel like that's definitely one thing I just want to at least witness for like a hot second. Um, so, since this has given you another quest... Uh, unfortunately, I believe we are out of time. This is a good spot to stop. Yeah. Don't so, forget to save. Yeah, you probably should save. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> uh, but that was that was a mission. At least we did find those kids in the forest, right? Like, at least we it's found all about the some of them, right? We didn't find yeah. all of them. That was cool. This is, uh, yeah, the telekinetic blast. Wow. That is pretty this cool. This trap thing. Sorry, this we're going to watch all the powers. This is good for ghosts. For finding As ghosts? Fighting ghosts. Oh, fighting. Yeah. Because they're ghosts. I mean, like, they can go through walls, but they can't go through this trap thing. So I it's like that. a quick salt circle that you drop. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, so if you guys want to play The Witcher 3, uh, I don't know, it's kind of an old game. You might already have it. But if you don't, uh, we have a pinned comment in the chat uh, where you can pick it up. Otherwise, uh, happy anniversary to The Witcher. Uh, and we will see you again next Supercon line uh, when we are playing something else. Well, we will announce it on our social media. Keep Follow our social media for more updates. Uh, tomorrow, we will be doing a live stream of Jackbox Party Pack with uh, Lava. So keep an eye out for that tomorrow at 6 p.m. Eastern Woo Time. Woo woo! I'm excited. They're actually there's some of so Max and and Raymond and uh, uh, Robbie. They're all like uh, the greatest. It's gonna be a good time. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know if he said anything in hearing. He said he was. He said they are. Then he took. A break <laughs> Did he said just the greatest? <laughs> <laughs> uh, 
Uh, all right. Well, thank you for joining us, everyone. Thank you, uh, Derek, for playing, for walking us through The Witcher. Thank you, Sarah, yeah. for for bringing some of your Witcher knowledge to the <laughs> for to commenting, the <laughs> for commentating. And uh, that's that's all I've got for you guys tonight. Have a good night, everybody. Say goodbye. Bye. Bye. Beautiful sunset to be leaving on. I know, right. <laughs>